Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls 3 with your story, Lord of the Mad. Now, it's time for us to travel onwards to the Undead Settlement. So that's gonna be fun. I was about to read the note, not about to raise the thing. I'm really surprised to see you here. And you. And you. Hold my hand. Yes. I'm afraid of heights. Both of you, hold my hands. Don't drop me. And they just dropped me atop this tower. But nothing even matters to them. I feel so, so betrayed. Alright, I don't think there's any loot up here, but uh, you know. But there is. Okay. I was about to say, but we're gonna check anyway, but you know, apparently there was actually just the smallest bit. Just the smallest bit of loot there. Like a teeny tiny bit. Ah, look, crowd. It's cool though. Because, guess what? Dogs! And the dogs don't like these folks! Just look at those souls come in! Oh, you don't like me either, eh? 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 That's cool! You really thought we had something special, man. Thought we had something special, dog. Dog. Hey, what are you doing there? Just chilling? That's cool. That's cool, because we're gonna go that way now. Because we can. And uh, we're gonna have to go ahead and see about getting us... Oh, hello. That's two more dogs. Dogs. I forget about their existence. Ah, they were annoying at an alluring skull and that does occur. Are you dead? 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 Why are you dead? Some homeless bones here. Are you dead? 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 <laughs> Please, grant me death. Undo my shackles. <laughs> You're not dead. You're cool. Oh. Oh, then it's true. A champion of ash as I live and breathe. To be in your presence is a great honor. I am Yol of Londor, a pilgrim, as you can see, only somehow I failed to die as was ordained. Well, perhaps my calling lies elsewhere. Say, Champion of Ash, how does the idea of taking me into your service strike you? I was once a sorcerer. Surely I can be of use. We're going hollow. Oh. I am honored, truly. I should be dead, yet you have granted me purpose anew. I, Yol of Londor, do solemnly swear myself to you. Awesome. We are going to head back to the Firelink Shrine and talk to the guy just as soon as we reach the next bonfire. Which is not at all far away, so it's gonna be cool. She's gonna be fine. Then we can become a warrior of sunlight. Because that's also cool. Yeah, you're gonna walk away now? 
Huh? You're gonna walk away now? I don't have none of that. It's bullshit. Alright, what's here? Try plunging attack. I think not. Alright, let's light that bonfire. Ah, oh, look, there's a friend up there. And then we'll rest at the bonfire and we will travel back to Firelink Shrine. Though had I waited, I could probably have gained additional stuff. Alright, hello. How are you doing, buddy? Oh, our champion of Ash. Welcome home. This pilgrim, with a debt in death, hardly deserves to behold this divine flame. And I never would have, had you not taken me into your service. I thank you dearly for this, and assure you of my leal service. That's good. What's this? Then shall we begin? Bearer of the dark sign, let your true strength shine. I think I can only get one point from this right now. You know, we really, 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 really are quite low on the whole... Uh, bigger point. Even the health point. On the other hand, more strength from dexterity, that could also work. There's like so many things we could... Do with this free point, but I'm gonna take that extra bit of health for now. As I have said, I was once a sorcerer. Alas, the magic of Londor is a far cry from the wonders of Vinheim. But I can teach you what I know. Perhaps more importantly, I believe that I can help tease out your true strength. We pilgrims of Londor are keenly aware that those branded by the dark sign possess something quite special. As I have said, a lot, but perhaps I Okay, weep thanks. The... What are you telling, actually? Oh, cool. Be See. safe, yeah. champion of Ash. Goodbye. Alright then. And you? Oh, hello, you're back. And in one piece. Well, now it's time I do my part. Whatever trinket you need, speak up. Just don't ask me where I got them. <laughs> what do you have? Ah, some items. Okay, uh, let me sell you all my firebombs. I guess that's a good plan because I'm still gonna get more of them, I think. Uh, there's not gonna be enough souls here, I don't think. But it just might be. Now nah, let's not do it for now. Do me a favor and don't give this ring to old Loretta at the base of the high wall. A nuisance, I know, but it will help me tie up some loose ends. It's cool. Goodbye, and stay safe. Oh, this place is a bore. What good is thievery if you've nowhere to go? <laughs> well, he's gonna be willing to go on like top secret TV missions, so that's cool. You know what? I still need to see what how the broadsword compares. Ah, it is good. What needs? I don't think I can. I can use the broadsword. All right, I think the broadsword might actually be superior, so we'll do that. Pretty be careful, I don't. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh. There's of course the chance that it has a shorter range, but it's a chance I'll have to take for now. 
And then we'll go back to down that settlement. Because that sounds like such a nice place, doesn't it? I'm not at all expecting to simply go ahead and die. So that's nice. Okay, close the gate. Close the gate on the hounds, dude. Or not. Now the gate closed itself. That's alright. Oh, I thought there was gonna be something there. Ah, people. Of this fine settlement. It looks like you've been expecting me. Except it didn't really, but you know. I just wanted to, you know, seem like a nice guy. Hello. I will take none of the time wishing shit. Except I probably will at some point. Hey dude. What's up? What are you hiding here, eh? Prepare about it. Well, this is no katana, but I guess. Okay, I had to let the guy down. The guy living. Alright, hello. You say you just wanna fight you? Okay. Oh, so this doesn't have a stabbing thing. What's the charge look like? Yeah, no stabbing. So that's one of the differences, I suppose. Grab that bone. You could say I picked that bone because I had a bone to pick with that. Oh, you distracted me. That's no good. I did. I did work well with distractions, you know. Okay. Right, well, the madam is returning to her post, so... I have no intention of going melee with her. Okay, do you have intention of going melee with her? So that was unwise. Most unwise. Well, who wants to fight me next to you? No, oh, we're actually gathering a group now. No. Wait, wrong potion. Last given. Close enough. To, you know, to really make a difference. Like wrong Sunny D. So the point was. Was it Sunny? Can we grab this item? Yes, it's an extra shard. So it's good to grab the item. Very good, indeed. Oh. You wanna fight too? What is this? Fight club? It's not fight club. It's just a place where everyone wants to fight me. It's called like down square or something. Oh, we got a worker hat and worker trousers. 
I need to see this hat. It's looking silly, but okay, yeah, all right. While I love this crown, this worker hat is looking wonderful for us right now. I may feel tempted to just dress up really sillyly. Silly lily. Lily. You know, we're pretty good for now. I'm still gonna have that second drink now. Especially since we got additional stuff for that. Hello! This crying noise really bothers me. It's as, as if someone in this area was highly unhappy. Like, is there anything in this corner? Oh, yes, there is. Oh, yes, there is. See that over there? That's an enemy. Man, this is some creepy shit here. Especially considering the size of the area. It should be cool though. Oh fuck, I forgot about that guy. I certainly forgot about those guys, so... This is what we call a tactical retreat. To prepare something against those ambushing bastards, alright? He looks really scary. And I quite remembered him being scary, so... That's why I treated him as if he was scary. Just so we know. So waking him up in melee range is not a good idea because he gets like an automatic kickoff. Good to know. Anything here? Oh, there's something there, alright. Yeah, never mind this direction then. Also, he's like... She, he, she, whichever is shooting out like leeches or something. Okay. That's not very nice. Does this door open? From the other side it does. I think it was an ambush. I think I might not be wrong. Um. Oh, this is where you got the warrior son from. Wait, what? Is the soup? I didn't know that was a thing. All right. Let's pledge ourselves to the warriors of sunlight. Yo. Covenants are really flimsy in this because you can just switch around. I don't, and I don't think there's any penalty for just switching around. So yeah, that's that's a thing. Oh hey, you, you dropped your axe. That's cool. All right, I don't remember where this particular path leads. This is too very sturdy though. Oh, is that the same path? Yeah, it probably is. Alright, then that's cool. 
I guess. Oh, you're here. Hello. You know, we do have the souls. We have to also consider the item souls to get ourselves the key that I desire. So, I'm not entirely... Happy about risking this path instead. It certainly looks like that's what they're doing. Especially since I forgot how to block. So it was less forgetting and more like, oh, I don't need to block. Okay, see this stuff here? Like, I have no idea how to handle that, so fuck that shit. Maybe if I had a bow, which you don't have. Well, I do have a bow, but it's not something I use, ever. Alright. So what have we got? We have a large soul of a desecrated corpse, that's cool. And we've got this guy. Look at the size of the thing! Imagine what strength score he must have to wield such thing without issue. This is so tiny, you see. Did you jump down yet? Oh no, you're doing range attacks. Okay. In that case, I'm gonna wait for him to jump down. And then I'm gonna stab him. Tactics. Well, I can't stab you if you're up there. Come on, get down from there. Silly net. Or don't. It's your choice. Now see, that's why I didn't want to go down that other path, because that ambush place is full of those people. Literally full of them. There's like a thousand. Well, not thousand, like ten. And they're all just hanging around on rooftops. Chilling. Die, please. No? Die, please. No, I just can't hit him. Okay, well. Now we're really low on all sorts of Estus. Don't you want to come down here? Like I've usually fought him on the ground, so this is really weirding me out. Huh. Okay. I'm gonna give you one more opportunity to die. Alright? Oh, you've gone ahead and hidden on the other side of the bloody building now. You, sir, are what I believe is called a twat. Huh. Oh, there we go. Oh, fuck! That was really bad. Like, I was just trying to see exactly where he went. <laughs> and they fucked up really bad there. Okay, I'm gonna go and get my retrieval. What did you give me? Oh, I've got worker carbs as well now. I could be a full worker. Look at me. Look at me, look at me, look at me. He could do work now. Yeah. Except I don't have worker gloves or anything like that. Theoretically, we could do work now. You know what? Does it, does it trousers seem to provide some re resemblances of defense, so we'll grab that. Nope, that's not what I had in mind. Alright, give it another try. Oh, I didn't mean like that. Yeah, that's more like it. Like one 
It wasn't me to be the one not doing the thing. Okay, Mr. Chandelier. And let's grab my retrieval. <laughs> because I just bloody walked off the edge of the thing. Oh, and there we go. Now you're just down here. Like chillaxing. No, that's unfair. That's not what I wanted. Hello, that kind of shot. For me, how amazing. I feel very much take that, thank you. And the bonfire, also for me. Who <laughs> would have expected me to take that as well? And then I'll call the episode here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.